Yeah, I had me a woman like that. I woke up one morning and she was gone. Took off the parts unknown. I ain't go off looking for her. I let her go. Figured she had a time to come to herself and wasn't no use of me standing in the way. Where are you from? Hmm? I'm from North Carolina. Down around Raleigh where they got all that tobacco. I've been up here about two weeks. I likes it fine, except, well, I have got to find me a woman. You have got a nice look to you. Looks as if you be having men sent at your door. You got men sent at your door trying to get a look at you. <laughs> a woman like you needs a man. <clears throat> Maybe you let me be your man. I got a nice way with the women's. That's, that's what they tell me. Look, 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 look. Woman. Like you? You can't be by her lonesome. <laughs> Life is like you gotta take a chance. Everybody gotta take a chance. Can't nobody tell you what's gonna be, so come on. Take a chance with me and see what the year bring. <sighs> you do this, no pressure. <laughs> you can't. Not without me. Let's slow it down, Pippin. We don't need any distractions. But it's the publisher. Listen, we hit a few rough patches, all right? Let's just finish this last chapter, and then we can get back in the swing of things. Be great. What do you say? Leave me alone. Can't. We're not done. From me. You're not real! If I'm not real, why don't you just let me go then? Just let me disappear. Fuck the book and fuck you. Look at that. See that, girl? See that? Yeah, I see. Ruby tell me my dirt ain't worth nothing. It's mine. It's worth it to have. I ain't gonna let nobody take it. Talk about my dirt ain't worth nothing. Like I need some good dirt. A seed is a seed. A seed will grow in dirt. Hey, look at that! Yeah, I see. How many of them refrigerators you said? I sold two more. 
One man owe me fifty dollars. Say he gonna pay me on Tuesday. How many you sell? I sold three. That makes seven. We ain't got but four more days to sell as many as we can. Then they're gonna move them down to Philadelphia, and we be done missed our opportunity. I be asking everybody. You just ain't asked the right people. It ain't like they TVs. TVs would be easier. This is better than TVs. Everybody already got a TV. But everybody be thinking about getting a new refrigerator. Only they don't ever get around to it. That's when you walk up and offer them a brand new GE refrigerator for two hundred dollars. That make you a hero. People be seeing you ten years from now smile when they see you. They'll never forget where they got that refrigerator from. Hey, King, I was thinking. I want to get my money out the pot. Need to get me some furniture. <laughs> no. <laughs> nah. We supposed to get the video store. We split the pot and there won't be nothing to get it with. We got around six thousand dollars. We don't need but four more. I ain't gonna be poor all my life. See, you don't believe. I believe it. I just need me some furniture. I need to. I need two hundred and twenty-five dollars to get my phone back on. Natasha talked to some nigga in Baltimore for six hours. I need to. You don't hear me talk about dipping in the pot. See, because I believe. I look at that sign saying Miller Auto Parts. They just don't believe it can say Headley Auto Parts or Carter Auto Parts. Or you can have one say Royal Videos. How do you think Miller got that auto parts store? Because he didn't dip in the pot. I need to get me some money. We can get the video store later. I just want my money. It's been sitting in the pot all that time. I don't even know what a pot is. You say you got it, but I ain't seen it. I just want my money. <laughs> we already talked to the man about running the place. He said come back when we're ready. We almost ready. Now you're talking about splitting the pot. You want your money. This is why niggas ain't got nothing now. They don't believe I me. just want my money. I need it. I got to get me some furniture. I need the money from the refrigerator so I can get my phone back on. Time to get pregnant. She want a car. I got to buy a crib, a stroller. Got to figure out how to get room in one of these refrigerators. I got the light bill, the gas bill. Got to get some food, but I ain't said nothing about dipping in the pot. You supposed to pretend like it ain't there. I didn't know Tanya was pregnant. I just found out myself. Remember when we used to play touch football and everybody would look at me and we'd do that double reverse and I'd hand off to you? I was a touchdown every time. I used to tell Nisi I wanted to have a baby. Wanted somebody to hand the ball off to. Took me all this time. Now time to pray. It's like I finally did something right. That's why you got to leave your money in the pot. I don't want him to go up without enough. I'm supposed to get a raise on my job, but I can't count on that. I need some place to sleep. I just want my money. We can start another pot later. Okay. Okay. <clears throat> that jewelry store we was talking about, and I told you I didn't want to do that. Down there on Fifth Avenue, I told the distributors. I told you we could take that easy. Might get around twenty or thirty thousand. The lease will be around ten thousand. Leave your money in the pot. We hit the jewelry store. We have another video store, and you can still get some furniture. All right, we want to do it. Got to do it soon. I need me some furniture. <coughs> I can take off work Wednesday. That's as good a time as any Wednesday or slow day. All right, we'll do it Wednesday. Really, Nina? Not even a court? Not even a judge? Not even the law, right? Because all I got to do is make problems for Renee and I will never see my son again. You'll put me in a court and I'm gonna lose every time. Judge see me, and she ain't gonna care that I started hustling in the first place to feed my family. She ain't gonna see that I was trying to be the best father I could be by making sure Renee ain't had to worry because her BS call center job didn't pay her for maternity. Ain't no judge gonna care that I couldn't get nothing legit because of some time I spent locked up for stabbing some niggas trying to rob me. She's gonna see me as one thing, Nina. The stain in my son's life. That's it.